Hello friends, this is Umesh and here in this video, I am going to show you how you can interface LM35 which is an analog temperature sensor to Arduino Uno and get the data, temperature data on your serial monitor of Arduino Uno. So basically, if you look at how this LM35 looks like, you might be having in your hand, but if not, then you can see this image in, in the left right side of the screen. So this LM35 looks like a transistor, it has a three legs. So the way you connect this LM35 sensor to Arduino Uno is this way that if you take the flat surface of this LM35 sensor towards you, I mean this, the written something, whatever it is written that LM35 or something 35, 36, if you keep this towards you and if you put onto the breadboard and then you take the extreme left pin of this LM35 and that will be the VCC and that's why the the left extreme left pin will connect to 5 volts of Arduino Uno if you just follow my mouse cursor. Then there is a middle line which is nothing but V out which is the output from the sensor. So, so you need to connect this V out pin that is a center pin to A0 pin of your Arduino Uno. You can see I have connected and it is represented by blue line. The extreme right pin by keeping the flat surface towards you will be your ground so that will be represented as a black line and it should be connected to the ground pin to arduino uno now you might be wondering that here it is written arduino dh mila though so doesn't matter which arduino you have i mean uh, the arduino dh mila and arduino uno has a same physical footprint so the pin doesn't change so just forget about this arduino dh mila if you have arduino uno this this connection works perfectly fine okay so once you are ready with this uh, connections you can move on and write a software for getting data from this lm35 sensor so let me start writing a code this is the body of the code that you can get every time when you create a new sketch so i can first define a variable float variable called temp this variable will be a placeholder for the data that we will be reading from this lm35 sensor so of course the temperature is always in uh, in some decimal places so we should give this into uh, the float variable then we need a serial monitor so i can give serial dot begin to enable the serial peripheral and i would keep the baud rate to become 9600 okay now in the loop function i should have to write um, the temperature that is the variable which holds the data from the sensor and as you know this output from the sensor the center pin you can see if i zoom in this image the center of pin is going to a zero pin that is the analog pin zero because this is the analog sensor that's why we have to connect to a zero and that's why we will write analog read this is the built-in function from arduino and we can give a0 so it will read the data from a0 pin where our sensor is physically connected now we know that this uh, temperature data that we will be reading is not in a degree centigrade so we will multiply this data from the sensor by multiplying factor 0 0.4882 and whatever it is right now you might be wondering where this this uh, uh, comes from right so what i can do is i will open and the calculator and i will show you how i have calculated this uh, this value so basically your input voltage is 5 volts so i'm going to uh, divide this 5 volt 5 divided by 1024 because the adcs are 10 bit so 2 raised to 10 1024 that's how you get 0 0.004882 and this and that now this is in in a millivolt so you have to convert it into the volts so if you if you multiply by 1000 then you will have this 4.8221 or something but according to data sheet a uh, 10 millivolt represent a one degree centigrade so i'm going to divide by 10 and that's the way i get 0 0.4882 and this and that and i have multiplied here with this the data that is coming from the sensor multiplied by this and that will give me the exact temperature now i want this uh, output to be look a little bit better so i would say serial dot print i want to print this on a serial monitor so that i can confirm whatever it is coming is it a right or not so i would give temperature 
and then I should again say zero dot print and I will give the value not value the, the variable name which hold the temperature in degree centigrade then i will say serial dot print i would again do a little bit some extra lines of code which will make this code even more readable than the earlier one so i can say star and c that means a degree centigrade and then i would just simply say serial dot print print ln so the next data whenever it reads the next value it will be printed into the new line and then i would say delay of every second that means a thousand milliseconds so if i upload this sketch then i would expect to get some data means a degree centigrade temperature from lm35 sensor so let me upload the sketch and see if i can get the data that means a degree centigrade a temperature data from LM35. So let me upload this edge. And hopefully I would get the temperature. So done uploading and I can open a serial monitor. And you can see right now the temperature is showing on my screen. 28 um, degree centigrade so to say. So let me hold the temperature sensor in my hand and see if it can change. So now it's a 29. So let me hold a little tight. So that the temperature will increase you can see it's a 30 now you can see now 31 so that way you can measure a temperature i hope you will find this video educational and entertaining see you in the next video bye bye